Want to see what I'm doing? I burned all this oil. This is Nancy today. I burned the oil yesterday. And then when it solidified, it was quite white. You can't see it under there anymore, but it's quite white. So what I've done is I've added a whole bunch of water. And I'm going to let it boil and see if it'll separate the fat from the burn. Now likely it'll smell horrible and it'll be useless anyway. But I would like to find out. Because at the moment it sure looks ugly, doesn't it? But the fat, when it was frozen outside or cold, see it was all white. It was white with speckles of burn in it. I just have to try things, you know. I'm also making crab apple jelly over here. Or crab apple jam. I have this is this is what's left after I strained it. And I see some of the liquid has come to the bottom, so I should probably hang this up in a pillowcase. But I don't know. And then over here is more. And over here is more. I have to make these into jam. But I don't think I have enough sugar. That's all the sugar I've got is two containers. And that is certainly not enough sugar to make that much jam. Oh well. So I'll just get it ready. In the meantime, bring this to a boil. Look at how gross it looks. Most people, most normal people would just throw it out. Oh my gosh, look at that. My battery light is on. See, it's melting the fat. There's the fat. See how white it is? I mean, relatively speaking, which gives me uh, the hope that perhaps it will um, separate completely. And you just never know. But first it has to melt. All that black. See, I could just, I thought, well, maybe it's already separated, you know, but if you look at this layer, you see, oops, it may be that it has separated. Maybe that is a good layer. Maybe I should just take that out. But you see, I think there might be, oh, I think there might be more. I, did I get it in my camera? Not quite, but almost. Oh, yes, I did. Sorry about that. Guess I'll have to fix that. Fat. Not a good thing on your camera. You probably could have told me that was going to happen too, right? If only I would have listened. Battery's going to die. I have this turned way down. See my mess? I have a big mess everywhere. Can't even cook dinner because I have too big a mess. See? Now my daughter in Germany says, Oh, it's always a mess. This is the way it is. Oh, look, here's my nettles. I wonder if they're ready. And here's the... What is this one called? Horse something? I can't remember what it is. It's for broken bones. All right. La, la. Oh, ho, ho, I push it on the bottom. Doesn't like that. But it'll melt it. So this could work, you know. I mean, there is a possibility. I don't know if it's going to smell bad, though. I mean, you can't make soap and sell it if it stinks. But you could make soap and use it for scrubbing the walls. Except I don't scrub the walls. Maybe you could tell that. Maybe I need to. I'm holding it down on the bottom. It's going away though. See how quickly it's solidifying? Splashed it on my arm. This stuff is something else. So all that, I mean there was about two or three inches two inches I guess of fat 
and the rest is water on top of it. This burns so long after I put it outside it still for about 15 minutes it looked like it could burst into flame. I don't know how hot it was. When you're melting fat don't leave it on high and you should watch it. Rendering fat. Now I'm clarifying it. I think that's what this is called, right? When I'm adding the water and it's going to separate. Look at that. Look what it looks like. Isn't that cute? Artistic. Look at those nice holes. Now, when this boils, it could suddenly boil everywhere and make a huge, dangerous mess on my stove. Burst into flames and burn my house down. So, I guess that means that I'm going to have to pay super duper attention. Uh oh. Right now, I need to get one of those things to rub it. Here it is. Okay, now I need to turn it down. There was a little bit of soap left on the pot from when I had done the soap. So you have to let this boil just a little bit so that it'll separate the fat and I don't know somehow it does it when you let it boil with all that water in it. You can't add the water to it. No, no. That would be a bad choice. But this, boiling it, will somehow remove the pieces from the fat. So that they can separate and then as the fat hardens at the top, it should be just lovely. So, okay, let's take this outside. There we go. And now we will just wait. And all the bits should go to the bottom of the fat, which should all be going to the top. Doesn't look like they're going to the bottom, does it? But it has time. Well, that's my experiment of the day. Don't burn your fat and you won't have to do this in the first place. Okay, goodbye.